You just found out that your wife has cheated on you and you want to turn this around. How do you do it in the fastest way possible? Obviously, joining the Move On After Betrayal program because it's a game plan. But outside of that, you're here because you want to know how to do that very specifically. And I'll give you one big tip on this. When you discover this, you have to decide what it is you want. What it is you want in your life outside of her. What do you want? Get clear on what you want and then decide, have the conviction to go after it no matter what the outcome. The problem is, is that guys get into this situation with their wives because they don't know what they want to begin with and they end up doing whatever they think that she wants. And then she moves the goalposts around. She's like, hey, do this for me and I will I'll want more sex. I will have more time with you. I want more intimacy. And what will end up happening is a guy will do that. And then the goalposts move and then they move and they move and they move and they wonder why the wife doesn't really respect them anymore. Is not really interested in him. It's because he doesn't have direction. He doesn't have conviction. He doesn't know where he's going. He's just doing whatever he can to try to make her happy, hoping that if she's finally happy, he'll get whatever it is that he deserves. But that's not how it works. Men go after what they want. And as long as they don't forget her and honor her on the way, on that process, then she will happily give him whatever it is he wants. He has to be the one who goes after what he wants. So whenever you get in a situation like this, the guy's like, I'll do whatever I have to do to get her back, which means I'm going to do whatever she wants. That's not it. You have to back up and say, no, I'm not doing that. I'm not going to reward crappy behavior by doing more of what you want. That's crazy. You cheated on me. I'm not going to do that. In fact, you ruined your relationship with me. Why should I trust anything you say? I'm going to go find out what I want to do in my life. Because obviously you don't really give a crap. You're going to go find out whatever you want. And I'm going to go find out what I want in my life. I'm going to go make it happen. Regardless of you, I'm going to leave. I'm out. And then from this place, she could say, oh, Matt, wow. Okay. Maybe he, uh, Maybe he's not a pushover. Maybe I need to rethink this. And then if she really wants to be with you, she will demonstrate it. She'll put in 110% of the effort. It's up to her to fix the trust at this point. It's not your job to go and try to force yourself to trust somebody who is untrustable. It's a bunch of BS. Go move forward with your life. If she wants to be a part of it, great. If not, great. But really, she's got a lot of work to do to make up for what she's done. And that's the first step that you have to do. It's the first mindset you got to be. Stop going after what she wants. Go after what you want.